This footage is from February 2013 and when I first started to uh, screw around with 600 volts and getting the machines running. Uh, I bought a used rotary face and, uh, you know, it wasn't the greatest. Initially, it took 27 seconds to start up this big, huge machine. And, you know, at that point in time, I was pretty happy. It was the first time I dealt into it. Now, Matt Matt, my partner with the VFDs, helped me add some capacitor banks to the existing rotary face. And we, I shaved that down to 19 seconds for the startup. And honestly, that's, a, that's pretty good. Um, now I'm running a North American one with what's called Smart Boost, where it checks the voltage drops and engages the start capacitors, which are also the run capacitors. And here she is today after wiring it in. And um, let's just say I'm pretty friggin' stoked because <laughs> it used to take half a minute. Look at that. 10 seconds, which is probably equivalent to line voltage three phase and read them and we check out these voltage legs they're within three volts